Well, consider yourself lucky. You are now an eyewitness to history. Bud Hedinger raving about Al Sharpton. And I raved about him on the radio this morning on Bud Hedinger Live, relating to the Zimmerman trial. You remember Al Sharpton was among those who got everybody whooped up shortly after the shooting, the big protest demonstrations, things turning ugly in Sanford, enormous political pressure applied that resulted in the overcharging of George Zimmerman with murder too, for which he will never be convicted in my view. But last night on his television show on MSNBC, Al Sharpton said, the people of Sanford, people everywhere, need to react in a non-violent way regardless of what the verdict is that is rendered by the jury in the Zimmerman trial. He could have said inflammatory things to drive his own agenda. He could have said absolutely nothing. But Al Sharpton said what I think is among the most important things that have been said in recent days related to the Zimmerman trial, and he had company. The attorney for Trayvon Martin's parents, Sabrina Fulton and Tracy Martin, uh, Ben Crump, also said that the family implores everyone to accept the verdict, whatever it happens to be, and not take the law into their own hands. He could have been inflammatory. He could have said nothing. And I think to have key black players surrounding the Zimmerman trial make a public appeal like that was a very, very positive thing. And whether or not there are any other political motives, ulterior motives, or whatever, which I always suspect with Sharpton, um, i got to give them props. i got to rave about it. They sucked it up, and they said the right thing. And that could make a huge difference. That's what I think. What do you think? Join me for the next edition of Bud Hedinger Live right here on 104.5 WFLA and AM 540 WFLA. We'll see you then.